I think there's a decent chance, depending on when our licenses are granted, that we would catch the booster within the next year or maybe less than a year. And then hopefully, if, if we get lucky, we might catch the ship towards the end of next year. And where does the catch take place? Is it Willie Mays in the middle outfield over his shoulder or is it Florida somewhere? I know it, it's the, 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 both the booster and the ship come back to the launch site. Okay, fantastic. Yeah, that, that's what I mean by the, 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 the in fact, I mean, the, the, the thing that, since, since we need a giant tower with customized uh, arms to lift the, the booster and the ship onto the launch pad, we don't absolutely need it. We can technically do it with, with, with humongous cranes on a low wind day, but that's it's quite unwieldy. The, 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 the tower with the arms is capable of lifting the booster and the ship even on, 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 a, on, on a very windy day, or moder moderately windy day. So then it just seems to me that, well, if we can lift the, the, the ship and the booster, the, the ship onto the, onto the launch stand, or the, the booster onto the launch stand and the ship onto the booster with those same arms, we should be able to catch the, the, the booster and the ship with those same arms. You know, we've, we've gotten pretty good with, with, with the thruster-based landing. And in fact, we, we can make, the, we can make the, the rocket hover in midair.